Hi, Genshin Impact is a popular third-person action RPG that has gained immense popularity among players on PC, PlayStation, and mobile devices in a short period. Its main distinction is not only its vast open world and numerous side quests and activities, but also its cross-platform play support. The main issue with the game is the need to spend a lot of time every day farming to develop your character team. If you're already tired of exploring Teyvat or just want something different, I've compiled a list of the best games similar to Genshin Impact that can also immerse you completely. And I'll start with Shurness The Lightning Kingdom. This is an adventure fantasy RPG in which five unique characters find themselves entangled in a story, and each stage of it will somehow affect the game world. The game tells the tale of a traveler through multiple different worlds, using a special power acquired from a spirit. He doesn't travel alone but with a company of four friends. The game features an intriguing setting, where humans coexist with anthropomorphic animals. Regardless of their race, everyone practices magic, and the main hero is destined to save this world from yet another catastrophe. The combat system allows you to engage in battles using various abilities with the five playable characters, including magic. Thanks to the role-playing system, you can learn new talents and spells. Since all our companions have different specializations, their strengths will aid in the journey some puzzle solutions and actions will be possible only through their unique abilities. The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild This is the first game that people compared to Genshin. It shares a lot of stylistic and mechanical similarities with Genshin. Of course, overall, these are very different games, but if you analyze them piece by piece, you can see many similarities. Many of Genshin Impact's mechanics are clearly borrowed from the explosive Nintendo hit, from the effects of various elemental attacks to the ability to cook exquisite dishes from ingredients found in the world. Here, you can also glide in the air, and puzzles are scattered throughout Teyvat just like in this game. Furthermore, Zelda features an open world with a non-linear storyline and is considered one of the greatest games of all time. It's a pity that the game is still exclusive to Nintendo consoles. The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom is a massive step up from Breath of the Wild, which is insanely impressive on its own. Nintendo absolutely knocked it out of the park with this sequel, giving players a larger Hyrule to explore while simultaneously giving them access to an array of new abilities and the power to piece together Zonai devices to create practically anything. With new and returning characters and an interesting look at the land of Hyrule during its beginnings, Link's arsenal of skills and abilities has also significantly expanded, not to mention the multitude of new features, including the building mechanics. In all other aspects, the new installment of The Legend of Zelda allows you to freely explore its magical world in every possible way. Whether you prefer running, swimming, riding a horse, or soaring through the sky like a bird. Dragon Quest XI If you've heard of the Dragon Quest series, then you might already know that Dragon Quest XI is the most recent installment from the main series of games. It's considered one of the greatest Japanese role-playing series of all time, and many argue that this game might just be the best in the series. Developed and published by Square Enix, this game features character designs that align well with the style of Genshin Impact. Combat in Dragon Quest XI is turn-based with a variety of mechanics, and takes place in rich environments. It's all tied together by a compelling narrative. At the heart of the story is the legendary hero and an evil sorcerer. The game offers numerous interesting quests, weapons, and NPCs to interact with, all presented in an attractive visual style. Sword Art Online Hollow Realization The fourth video game adaptation of the Sword Art Online light novel series, its events unfolding chronologically after Lost Song. The game's main protagonist is Kirito, who embarks on a journey through the world of Origin, a modification of Ankrad. Fans of the series will certainly appreciate the interesting gameplay features such as dating elements, and the ability to engage in battles in teams of four, utilizing devastating combos. However, the main advantage of the game is its extensive playtime, requiring more than 100 hours to complete. With the addition of DLC that enhances the already deep story, you get over 130 hours of captivating narratives.
Final Fantasy XIV, initially stumbling in its debut, underwent a remarkable transformation, ultimately establishing itself as a quintessential title within the franchise. This MMORPG, a must-try for enthusiasts of both multiplayer games and JRPGs, defied all odds and made a significant mark in the gaming world. The game's renaissance began with the release of version 2 after the lukewarm reception of its initial iteration. With this revamp, the game saw newfound success and has since captivated the hearts of gamers. While it diverges from the art style of Genshin Impact, Final Fantasy XIV shares an unmistakable familiarity once you delve into its expansive world. A grand narrative, where you feel like the protagonist without everything being too straightforward, awaits players. If you relish the open-world aspect of Genshin Impact, you'll find Final Fantasy XIV to be a fitting choice. It offers the freedom to explore the vast realms of Hydaelyn, divided into three breathtaking continents. Honkai Impact The previous project from the creators of Genshin Impact of course, the game wasn't as popular at the start, but there's still something to catch on to here. The game features a well-thought-out multiplayer mode where three players can team up for real-time battles with other similar players. The single-player mode offers an open world for us to explore by completing short story missions. Both games include collectible characters, trial towers, and emphasize character progression. Visually, the game bears a strong resemblance to Genshin Impact, and both games share the concept of a multi-universe and follow a free-to-play model. Immortals Phoenix Rising If you simply want to explore a vast, vibrant world and solve puzzles without having to worry about gacha mechanics or team management, then this Ubisoft adventure, inspired by the myths and legends of ancient Greece, is a perfect fit. Here, we step into the shoes of Phoenix, a young hero who finds himself in a land where his friends have been turned to stone, and monsters like harpies and gorgons rule the land. As we explore the world, we can climb, fly, and ride various creatures. Additionally, there's crafting, challenges, and a whole bunch of eccentric gods to encounter. An arcade-style action RPG with elements borrowed from JRPGs, featuring a plethora of mechanics, genres, and gameplay innovations. A party of heroes traverses a global map, battling monsters, collecting treasures, clearing dungeons, defeating bosses, and completing story quests. Battles take place on separate arenas, reminiscent of classic JRPGs, but unlike the latter, the combat is in real time. In addition to regular quests and battles, the game includes a system akin to Pokemon, where you can collect small creatures from around the world and summon them to aid you in battle. Furthermore, the game incorporates a kingdom management element, allowing you to enhance key buildings and higher NPCs encountered in the world. Xenoblade Chronicles 2 Another Nintendo Switch exclusive, and perhaps the best JRPG on the platform. The game shares a style similar to Genshin Impact, with an elemental combination system, open-world exploration mechanics, and much more. Following a fantastic storyline, players explore diverse regions, immerse themselves in their cultures, and battle monsters. Gradually, the main character assembles a loyal team of followers, and the journey leads to unexpected discoveries and the unraveling of ancient mysteries. It's an astounding game that you should definitely check out if you own a Nintendo Switch. Honkai Star Rail This is a standalone work that significantly differs from even the previous game in the Honkai series, although the developer's signature style is undoubtedly evident. It's essential to note that the battles here take place in a turn-based mode, reminiscent of classic JRPGs. In contrast to the vast expanses of Teyvat, this game offers an entire galaxy at your disposal, with numerous planets, each having a unique ecosystem, politics, missions, and enemies. Both Star Rail and Genshin Impact utilize the same gacha system to unlock characters, which, in this case, join the team on our spaceship. To make rapid progress, the player's primary task is to create a balanced squad capable of adapting to different enemies based on their vulnerabilities, so grinding is inevitable. Persona 5 Strikers you can argue that Persona is renowned for its turn-based combat system, which is significantly different from the dynamic battles in Genshin Impact. 
However, Strikers is an exception since its combat system is closer to action RPGs and slashers rather than traditional turn-based JRPGs. The game pits us against hordes of enemies, most of which can be dispatched with just a few precise strikes. For the first time in the series, all members of your squad can act simultaneously, and you have the freedom to switch between characters in battle, combining their unique abilities and super moves. However, in all other aspects, Persona 5 Strikers remains true to its roots, primarily staying a fantastic role-playing game. Scarlet Nexus This game became one of the most pleasant surprises of 2021 for fans of Japanese role-playing games. The action of this anime blockbuster unfolds in a futuristic world where people possess special abilities they must use to combat hordes of mutants called the Others. Although you have two main protagonists at your disposal, there is no option to freely switch between characters here. Instead, Scarlet Nexus places significant emphasis on team synergy, as your squad periodically includes other fighters with unique abilities and attacks. The game's combat system is dynamic and intricate, and as the story unfolds, it continues to expand, which is sure to appeal to fans of Genshin Impact. Fantasy Star Online 2 New Genesis a free-to-play RPG is an updated version of Phantasy Star Online 2, originally released exclusively in Japan. Similar to Genshin Impact, New Genesis is an ever-evolving project with solid fundamentals and abundant content. While both games draw inspiration from anime, Phantasy Star's visual style incorporates a touch of realism due to its strong emphasis on sci-fi themes rather than pure fantasy. The combat system in New Genesis is swift, gratifying, and offers diversity. Players can choose from a variety of distinctive classes, and even though multiple playable characters aren't available, there are numerous unique weapon types and playstyles to explore. Star Ocean This is a continuation of a series of Japanese role-playing games that offers players numerous features. For example, in the Divine Force, characters can freely fly, exploring a vast open world. The battles in this installment are also the most dynamic and action-packed among all the previous games in the series players can dive right into the thick of the action, delivering strikes from the skies. The story will change depending on the player's decisions. There are many different heroes, and most of them can be played. The game world itself represents a freely navigable environment, allowing players to reach everything they see on the screen. Tales of Arise excels as a remarkable action JRPG in its own right, with its unique identity despite sharing some similarities with Genshin Impact. The game offers a vast open world for exploration, challenging battles against adversaries, and character development opportunities. Its real-time combat system demands players skillfully chain attacks to execute combos seamlessly. Once you become adept at these combat mechanics, Tales of Arise emerges as a formidable rival to Genshin Impact. In the graphics department, the game showcases an atmospheric shader system, providing the design with a watercolor painting aesthetic that brims with intricate details, creating a comforting atmosphere. Real-time combat shines when chaining combinations together, and the storyline captivates while maintaining a well-paced narrative. Tower of Fantasy Developed on Unreal Engine 4, this game offers a captivating journey into a fantasy post-apocalyptic world with a stunning anime-style aesthetic. In Tower of Fantasy, players traverse desolate landscapes, taking on various quests, collecting valuable loot, and crafting equipment. One of the standout features of this game is its realistic physics system, which greatly impacts the gameplay. Players can engage in activities like rock climbing, swimming, and jetpack flight. Moreover, the ability to pick up and interact with objects, ignite grass, and enhance electrical effects with water adds a unique dimension to the gaming experience. These elements aren't just crucial in battles but also in solving numerous puzzles scattered throughout the game world. One of the significant deviations from Genshin Impact is the combat system. In Tower of Fantasy, the focus is on weaponry rather than characters. Players can wield various weapons and interchange between three at once, with weapons featuring both physical and elemental damage.
To conclude, I will tell you about two games that haven't been released yet, but based on their description and appearance, they promise to be just as good as Genshin Impact. Grand Blue Fantasy Relink This is an adventure fantasy RPG where you'll lead a band of adventurers who soar between celestial islands, exploring them and battling monsters in search of treasures. The game is designed for both single-player and cooperative third-person gameplay, with a maximum of four players. In single-player mode, AI takes the place of gamers. Each character has their own combat specialization, a set of moves, and combo attacks. Blue Protocol a Japanese fantasy MMORPG that every anime fan has dreamed of, featuring beautiful graphics on the Unreal Engine 4 and an intriguing storyline involving time travel. The game will focus on its narrative aspect, offering a variety of quests and numerous cutscenes. Players will have the opportunity to try out several character classes, with four promised at the start, each fulfilling different roles in combat. The game is expected to deliver a well-developed non-target combat system and multiplayer activities. In summary, it will be something akin to Genshin Impact but in the form of a full-fledged MMORPG. And with that, this episode has come to an end. The Image Game Channel was with you. Have a good day.